Hey guys, how are you doing today? This is Clovis from the Fritz and Maker YouTube channel. Uh, what I'd like to talk to you about today is this little circuit part in here, which has a TCS 230, 220, 230, 230 um, light sensor. And the differential of the sensor to, to an LDR or a photo transistor is that it can identify colors. So red, green, and blue like separate uh, channels of colors and white as well, of course. Um, it has four, LED, four white LEDs in here so that it, it can light the subject or the object you are, you are willing to identify color. It's lit by this, uh, those uh, white LEDs and it's going to read um, the, the R and G and B and convert there there's uh, in the same die of the sensor there is this converter that transforms red green and blue light to frequency so the frequency changes the, the frequency that goes to Arduino that Arduino reads changes with the color with red green and blue um, it's supplied by the same 5 volts as we supply Arduino so it also comes from Arduino and the, the sketch I made in here, it is such that it reads the color in here, the RGB color, and it lights this nail, this Adafruit nail pixel in here with the exact same color it is reading. Um, the code is available in the blog post, which is in the description below this video. Um, let, let me show you, let me show you guys this thing in here working. So I just powered Arduino up, right? Um, Let's see. So, one thing I figured is that if if you point this thing to like up to the to the ceiling lights or, or my recording light, it's gonna go crazy. You see, like the, this color does not represent what the sensor is reading right now. So, it's always good to to be in a very dark room, which I can't now because I'm recording this. But so I'm I'm pointing this down. I'm pointing this to the bench. So it's it's not gonna read the um. The color of the bench because it's like it's not very well calibrated as well but let me show you some objects for example this green scissor in here you see like i don't i bet you guys cannot see it right but it it is green in the video see now this this yellow folder in here you guys can see uh, there's this blue visitor card in here this one gets very blue the actual onion omega 2 um, sticker the, this one is, is not going very like it's more bright than purple but anyway it's a little bit purple and this white uh, prototype board it gets very, very whitey what if I put something black in here so I, I made my code such that the um, the RGB LED will go to zero, of course, because zero 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 is the RGB for black. Uh, what else? Let's let's try this blue in here. I, I haven't tried. So it it doesn't like um, just darker color, just like this blue. My even my finger, like my finger, goes a little bit red in the sensor. So guys, I. I hope you liked this video. Uh, this was just, oh, let, let me not do that. This was just to show what this TCS230 color sensor can do for you. It, it can be used, for example, to to recognize and to separate pieces in a, in a, in a machine, for example. If you, if you get this yellow piece, go like to one side. If you get uh, this blue piece, go to the other side and, and so on and so on. I just made this code to to illustrate and to show you that you, you can easily recognize separate red, green, blue and, and show it in a nail pixel. As I said, the code is in the description below. You can download, you can try this in your Arduino Uno. Um, of course, it's going to work in other Arduinos, but I'm trying with my uh, my Arduino Uno, which is this pretty home in here. Uh, I hope you like this video. I hope you subscribe to my YouTube channel. See you later, guys.